Hey guys, how you doing today? It's your girl, Ms. Debs, coming to you from here in my kitchen in Orange, New Jersey. Giving honor to my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, because he's so worthy to be acknowledged and praised on this day and any other day, wouldn't you guys agree? Because without God, there could be no me, no you, no us, no this. I thank him for my gift to be able to learn how to cook because it was a learning process. But guys, today, you know your girl, it's her passion to cook. So again, welcome to my channel. Now guys, today I'm going to be making a healthy version of blueberry muffins. We're going to make blueberry lemon muffins because we're going to add the lemon extract in it. So it calls for, calls for our all-purpose flour, one and a half cup, right? Then we're going to use one and a half teaspoon of baking powder. We're going to use a quarter teaspoon of salt. A half a, a half a cup of milk. I have lactate milk. Then we're going to use um, one fourth cup of oil. We're going to use a half a cup of sugar, one large egg, vanilla extract, a half a teaspoon, but I'm going to use lemon because we're making lemon, blueberry lemon muffins. And you're going to have 100 grams of fresh blueberries. We're going to put this in a preheated oven of 190 Celsius for 20 to 25 minutes. So we should yield nine muffins. So I'm over here getting my coconut oil. Instead of using oil, guys, I'm using coconut oil. Let's get this started. So we're going to do our, my dry first. Give me one sec. So we're going to start with our flour. One and a half cups. So I'm just putting it in here. And this is going to be so great, guys. I love blueberry muffins. So I have my cup and a half in there, right? Oh, let me let you see that. That's my cup and a half of flour. Now I'm going to use my baking soap. Now we're going to add the baking soda and the flour. This is the one and a half teaspoon. That's in there. Now we're going to use our salt. We're going to use a quarter teaspoon of salt. Just going to use a little. Now, guys, I'm going to mix this up. Mixing that up, right? So now I'm going to do my wet ingredients. So that is already incorporated. So let's get rid of all this stuff on the table because guess what? We don't need it anymore. I'm just one of those cooks that like to clean up as I go. Okay, now we're going to put our wet ingredients in here. So it calls for, we're going to put our blueberries in there. We're going to do our one egg. We're going to do our oil, which we're using coconut oil, and it's going to be a quarter cup. Right? Now we're going to put in our lemon extract. Right? I forgot I had measured it out already. <laughs> then we're going to put our sugar in here. And here's the sugar right here and our milk. So this is how I'm going to do this because me, being the neurotic that I am, I wanted everything to be measured out. I have my pan all oiled. Let's put our sugar up, our flour. All right, guys, so I'm going to mix up the wet and we'll be right back. Okay, guys, so this is just me. Whenever I do my muffins, I always put a teaspoon of sour cream in. It just gives, especially if you're doing like lemons or blueberry, any type of tart fruit, it just brings a nice flavor to the um, ingredients that you're putting together. 
So we have our dry ingredients here. I'm going to put a little well in the middle of it. And then I'm going to start adding all mine because you keep mixing this until the sugar has to dissolve. So I always put my blueberries with my mixture. That's just me. I know a lot of people probably don't do that, but I do that. So um, I'm going to, I made a well in the middle. So I'm going to start adding this. Start stirring it. And you want to you don't want to stir it too hard because you don't want to break your blueberries. I mean, eventually they're gonna break anyway, but I just try to keep them as whole as I could, as I can. So look, you're just stirring that. It's almost like a bowl, it's not a heavy, hard, brutal mixing. So I'm just going to mix this, guys, and I'll be right back. Now we're going to put the mixture inside the muffin tins, okay? So here we go. So it says it can yield nine. So let's see. And let me give you a tip, guys. When you're doing any type of soft uh, batter, always, if you're going to use like a cookie scooper or um, an ice cream scooper, what you do, you put oil. You dip it in the oil first, which I use coconut oil. And it'll help the... Um, ingredients come off the spoon see that because this is real sticky because it has um sugar it has eggs it has um blueberries Guys, these are so delicious. They look delicious and they taste delicious. Please try this recipe out. God bless.